All right, Cassie could be sitting on a piece of art that may be worth a whole bunch of money. I have had this piece since I can remember. It was gifted to me by a family member, and literally I grew up with it. And it is a framed original sketch of Winnie the Pooh. Um, I'm going to show it to you guys. It's signed by the artist. So you guys all what? know Winnie the Pooh, right? Yeah, Kristen and I right? went to a Winnie the Pooh exhibit at the at the museum. So it's by E.H. Uh, Shepard, artist Howard Shepard. And I have had it since I was a kid. You can see even the matting is super yellowed on it. Right. So I have literally been sitting on that, taking care of it. It's in my daughter's room now. I mean, I can't I don't remember when I got it, but it's been a fixture of my childhood. It's come with me from the UK to Louisiana to Georgia, all over the place. And it's probably one of my most prized possessions. So I uh, I've kind of always saw it as a get out of jail free card, you know, like I'm sitting on it. I don't want to sell it. But if things ever hit dire straits, I had this mm-hmm. original sketch by E.H. Shepard, a Winnie the Pooh sketch that I could sell, I don't know, to Christie's or an auction house or eBay, whatever, and make some cash. But the thing is, you know, it's always been behind glass and I've taken super good care of it and I never actually ever had it appraised. So I decided to get it appraised and I have a friend who works at an art gallery in uh, London, which will be, will be remain nameless. Her name's Genev, but she doesn't want to be associated because she's not allowed to give like um, appraisals outside of her gallery. So I sent it to her and she appraised it for me and sent it back. So I want you guys all to guess how much okay. you think this original piece of artwork is worth. All right. What's the, what's the history on it? Once again, it's from what year? It doesn't have a year on it, but it's Winnie the Pooh. It's by E.H. Shepard, so the children's scare, uh, series. And it's not a full-color illustration. It's just an original sketch. Okay. So and it's not actually which like characters? full-color. Which character? It's Pooh. Like- it's Winnie the Pooh. He's looking at something. So He's looking at something. So And you were holding on to this, like, just oh, in case now. someday, like, in the... Um, and like the small chance there was ever a pandemic or anything like that, you could lean on something <laughs> like this because you're not getting extra work. Hmm. Yeah, well, or at least I was thinking at least a couple thousand bucks. I don't know, though, but he's not alive anymore. He's not making any more mm-hmm. of these. And this is a classic. I am liking this. Not quite the same level, but <laughs> almost like a Disney sketch, right? Like, it's a huge world. Everyone knows Winnie the Pooh, and I have a sketch, and you know how clumsy I am. This has survived with me since, I don't know, for the last 30 years. Mm. Like, it hasn't broken. It's gone from state to state. Like, I've taken really good care of this, too. Kept it out of sunlight. So, again, the matting is yellowed, but it's in really pristine condition. And you've taken such good care of it for the eventual payday, is what you're saying? Well, no, because it was sentimental to me. It was it okay. was from a family member, but also, like, I knew it was a valuable piece of art, and it had been entrusted to me. And so, like, it's never, it's always been under glass the whole time, like, being... Hmm taken really good pristine care of it because it, it's an important mm-hmm. piece so if bart Kristen. and i are fortunate enough to get pregnant we're like the nursery is going to be classic winning the poo because that was my um nursery theme when i was a baby um if it's reasonable you're saying i can't buy it from you <laughs> <laughs> well it depends well, on the we price. don't know if you can afford it or not right <laughs> let's find out how much it is i'll go with uh thirty thousand uh, dollars i was how gonna much? say a thousand, thirty or a thousand 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 dollars a thousand mm-hmm. I'm going to um, say 2000 just because you're flapping it around like a Polaroid picture. Like, you don't have it in a glass case right now, so I don't think it was appraised for that much. <laughs> I'm going to say 1500 I'm going to go right in between the two of you. Mo? 20 bucks. 20 bucks? 20 bucks? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I Original actually think it's, <laughs> I'm kidding. I think it's worth a lot. I'm I'm actually going to say, like, 50 50000 All right. None of these guys wow. played the game right. I'm going, I'm $1. You can't One change. Dollar. You started. You are at a yeah, thousand. That's how thousand. that works. <laughs> this sketch is worth thirty thousand dollars. No, you with shut your just mouth. poo. You don't even what? have all the characters with just poo. What? With just poo. Just kidding. That's what I thought. Oh. So You're she sad. actually oh, the best. So she got it. I sent it to. Her. I sent this all the way to London. She got it. She removed the matting on the frame, and underneath the matting it says. Original drawings provided by Victoria and Albert Museum, printed in England, Reflex Marketing Limited, <laughs> Wellingboro, North Ends, England. It's an art print from the Victoria and Albert Museum. It's not a real piece of art. It's a friggin' poster that I have guarded for 30 years thinking it was a valuable treasure. But no, it's from Reflex Marketing 
limited copyright Disney. So about two dollars and thirty cents. Not even you can get it in the gift shop for less than a pound. <laughs> <laughs> like a dollar. This is the Bird Show.